going to talk today about powdering with color set powder. Now the first thing you want to do before you powder is to tap out all those pesky crevices in the white because if we don't fix them now, then it's going to set that way with the powder, which is bad. Okay. Nice and non-creviced. Yay. Then what we want to do is get out our puff because a puff is going to be a lot more efficient with color set powder than be, than a uh, sock would be because they'll be wasting a lot of powder that we don't want to do. So, ah, ta -da. branding. So, when I start with it. Get in on well, some on the puff. Now you don't want to go straight from puff to face always, because you end up with all you see all those little little extra chunks. That's no good. That'll make it uneven when we powder your face. So you want to kind of spread it out a little bit on the puff. Make sure it's even all the way across. All the way across. No crumbles. Yay. Now when you powder, you're going to want to press it in because that's really going to set the makeup. You might have to reload a couple times because you're using more powder while you do this when you press it in like that. But that's how you're really going to make sure that it's setting. It's going to take more powder in the eyebrow areas because the makeup's caked in between the hairs like that. So you're going to have to make sure that you go over there more than once. Now to test to make sure that your makeup is set, you get a little bit of powder on your finger. Sometimes it doesn't work coming in from the puff. Pull a little bit out of the container. Just a little bit, okay? And you're gonna check by touching it. And if it's sticky, it's not set. But this feels pretty good. Check the eyebrows, make sure, yep, see, those eyebrows still a little sticky. We gotta put a little bit more powder in them. Boop, 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 boop. There we go. And then the last important part is we have to brush off the excess because you can't just leave it forever and ever. Then when you hug children, there'll be a little puff of, of powder. You look like a dusty clown. Not a good plan. So this is the Cadillac, the goat hair brush. You can use other brushes, but this one's specially designed to take powder off of the face. So it's going to be faster, it's softer, it's easier on your face. It's my favorite, but I'm biased. That does not look nice. And there you have it. Ta-da! Not too shabby.